Come on. Took some damage from that. What the hell? Oh, hello. Nice reef. Well, that didn't last that long. Forgot there's creatures up here now and again. Hello. Take it. Take it. Drop anything interesting. I love the look of this bow. It just looks fantastic. I mean, look at that. That is uh, probably one of my uh, favorite um, looking bits of equipment I've ever seen. It's just this bow. It just looks freaking amazing. It's just all ethereal and uh, it looks cool. Kind of looks like as if it's all on fire, but you know, it's still as if it's a hologram and stuff. Real like the art team who did that. That's really cool. Finish what? Oh, I don't know. Come on, Faint. The goat. How the hell can he survive it? Well, I just forced rode out a goat. No, I didn't. I clear sky the goat. Could force rode out the goat off the mound if I so wish. Look at that shit. All right. As I said, I'll look around more when I'm actually on top of the world. This is the highest point in Skyrim. Obviously, look how tall it is. Ah, uh, Billy Go. Look at him trying to get up. Oh well. <laughs> yeah, stop whooping my ass. Here we are in the front of the world. Amazing. Where's Parfi? Drem your lord. That's Parfi. Greetings, Wundunik. I am Parthenax. Who are you? What brings you to my Strumach, my mountain? Uh-huh. I am as my father Akatosh made me, as are you, Dovahkiin. Tell me, why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? Hmm. Drem. Patience. There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the Dove. By long tradition, the Elder speaks first. Hear my Thum. Feel it in your bones. Match it if you are Dovaki. Yeah. 
Alright, working on it, Puff. Hang on. Bloody. So, you have made your way here to me. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. Even for one of Dova Sauce, Dragon Blood. What would you ask of me? How do I learn Dragon Run? Ah, I have expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Tinvak with an old Dova. No, you seek your weapon against Alduin. Alduin Comate Teed. What else would you seek? Alduin and Dovakin return together. But I do not know the Thum you seek. Croesus, it cannot be known to me. Your kind, Jaw, mortals, created it as a weapon against the Dove. The dragons. Our Hadrime, our minds, cannot even comprehend its concepts. Hmm. Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this Thum? <sighs> Stop Alduin. Yes, Alduin, Zembach, the elder brother, gifted, grasping, and troublesome, as is so often the case with firstborn. But why? Why must you stop Alduin? I'm the dragonborn. Hmm, true. But Kostid, prophecy, tells what may be, not what should be. Kostid Salo Ak, just because you can do a thing, does not always mean you should. Hm. Do you have no better reason for acting than destiny? Are you nothing but a plaything of Dez? of fate. Hmm. If you can see your destiny clearly, your sight is clearer than mine. Dahman, remember, Alduin also follows his destiny as he sees it. But I bow before your certainty. In a way, I envy you. The curse of much knowledge is often indecision. But you have indulged my weakness for speech long enough. Croesus, now I will answer your question. Hmm. Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monavin, what you name Throat of the World? It's quiet. 
<laughs> no dragons like mountains, right? Mm, true, but few now remember that this was the very spot where Alduin was defeated by the ancient tongues. Vaucht Unslad. Perhaps none but me now remember how he was defeated. Mm, yes and no. Viknuznikron. Alduin was not truly defeated either. If he was, you would not be here today seeking to defeat him. The Nords of those days used the Dragonrend shout to cripple Alduin, but this was not enough. Ok Mulag Unslad. It was the Kel, the Elder Scroll. They used it to cast him adrift on the currents of time. Hmm. Not intentionally. Some hoped he would be gone forever, forever lost. May ye. I knew better. Tidbo Amativ. Time flows ever onward. One day he would surface. Which is why I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I have waited. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. Hmm. Tid Krent. Time was shattered here because of what the ancient Nords did to Alduin. If you brought that Kel, that Elder Scroll, back here to the Teed Ahran, the Time Wound, with the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to cast yourself back to the other end of the break. You could learn Dragonrend, from those who created it. Krosis, no. I know little of what has passed below in the long years I have lived here. You are likely better informed than I. Hmm. Trust your instincts, Dovakin. Your blood will show you the way. So, basically... Drem your look. Greetings. Basically, hang on, let me talk to Pop. Thum. Speak. I will listen. Mm. I have taught the way of the voice for centuries, and the Thum since long before that. But no, Dovakin. Others do not come here to train anymore. Saran, you are the first in over a hundred years. I meditate on the Rotmulag, the words of power. I counsel in their use. It is enough for me. Hmm. Knowing a word of power is to take its meaning into yourself. Contemplate the meaning of a Rotmulag. You will become closer to that word as it fills your inner self. Will I teach you, Dovakin? What word calls you to deeper understanding? There are three to master. Fus, Faim, and Yol. Fus! It is called Force in your tongue. But as you push the world, so does the world push back. Think of the way force may be applied effortlessly. 
Imagine but a whisper pushing aside all in its path. That is Fus. Let its meaning fill you. Sum Ark Mora. You will push the world harder than it pushes back. Look, Thum. Alright, the basic idea of why I wanted to do that is because you can pick a specific word from, um, Elderwin. Not Elderwin. Uh, like, dragon word. From, where is it? Is it in here? No, oh, it's the top one. And, uh, basically you just get an active ability, so I picked Force. So it's, it's easier for me. So it includes normal attacks as well, from what I found. Like, if you do a power attack, it doesn't really affect me as much. But um, if you melee, then it, it does. It's, it works. also works with Fus Roda as well. Um, people lay on the floor for longer. Stuff like that. Um, it's just little effects that you can throw in as well. It's really cool. Now, if I remember correctly, there is an Easter egg. And I can't remember where it is. Is it up here? Is it up there? It may be up there. Or if not, it is... Might be an idea to save. No, me, I'll end up falling off. I don't think it is up here, but I think it's on top of there. There being all the way up here. If I can get up there, cool. If I can't, well, too bad. Most people should already know about this. Come on, get up there. Come on, McCraigie! There we go. Moving. Moving and a grooving. Moving. Come on. Come on. Come on. Keep going. Throw the world. Da da da. Da da da. Da da da. Nearly there. Come on. Up. I wish it could allow me to just constantly keep jumping. What's up here? There's ore up here, isn't there? Match a lit and why not? Ebony. Mine ebony ore, but this The pick in the uh the earth wait where'd it go? Notched pickaxe. It's uh Races the Wilder Smith in ability and does five shock damage. This is uh, a reference to Notch who uh Obviously made Minecraft. That's uh, that's the idea of that little Easter egg.